Now, every campaign needs a sharp American strategist, supposedly, and Leave.eu have Jerry Gunster. His job is to mastermind its campaign to persuade Britons they are better off without the European Union, and we'll be speaking to him in a moment. But first, Leave.eu have some new polling out today. They asked a sample of British voters whether the UK should remain a member of the European Union. 42% said it should remain a member. 38% said it should leave, with 20% undecided. Leave.eu also asked people what they feel about the EU principle of free movement. 48% said free movement makes them feel unsafe. 9% said it makes them feel safe. And 33% said it makes no difference. And who should be the face of the anti-EU movement? 26% want the UKIP leader, Nigel Farage, while the London mayor, Boris Johnson, is the preference for 13%. Home Secretary, Theresa May, is the third favourite. And Leave.eu's Jerry Gunster joins us now. Welcome to The Daily Politics. Thank you. Thank you for having me. Jo. You're welcome. Andrew. You face an uphill struggle if you look at that polling showing that people, more people prefer to remain in the EU. Mm -hmm. We do. Um, and I think that uh, there is something inherent about referendums, um, which is one of the reasons why I'm working here with Leave EU, and that is that most people, when it comes to referendums, want to vote to keep the status quo. And you see, for example, in the United States, 60% of all referendums and what we call initiatives fail. They fail because people don't want to make the change. However, there is precedent and there are a lot of times when people will go that way. You've got to look at like a, pill, a game of billiards, right? This is a double bank shot. One, we've got to be able to convince people that there is a problem and then the second part is we've got to show them that there is a solution to that what's problem. A, what's a double bank shot? <laughs> well, <laughs> well, I think you're playing now. pool, Andrew, and you billions. hit one bank and you hit the other bank in pool. Oh, billiards. Yes, billiards. Okay. Or double shot. Now, what would be your main stick, if you like? I mean, would that focus your double-pronged attack uh, on immigration or economics or both? Yeah, you know, I think it's a combination of all of the above. Um, the polling is showing that there are three issues right now. One, it's immigration. Two, it's the economy. And three, it's the issue of should we have the rights to make our own laws here in the UK as opposed to having it come out of the EU. What do you think should be central out of those? I mean, if you look at the, the, the polling that shows the EU principle yeah. of free movement, I mean, perhaps unsurprisingly, at the moment, 9% of people feel safe, bearing in mind yeah. it's in the context of what's been happening. 48% feel um, unsafe. Is that where you're going to focus your efforts? I don't think there's any question about it. Right now, immigration is the number one issue. Um, the economy is number two. Now, I will say that doesn't mean that that's the way it's going to be in six months or in a year. I mean, this, these, these referendums are extremely volatile. You saw that in Greece. You saw that with the Scotland referendum. Numbers were all over the place. So, yeah, today it's immigration. Tomorrow it could be the economy. The third could be something else. Jerry, I'm afraid we're going to have to interrupt this interview just a moment because we've got uh, Labour MP John Mann, who is in the House Indeed, of Commons. Indeed, we're just going to go straight over live to